Hey everyone, this is just me a quick video showing the ska on my Shinwa Odachi after I shortened it, but I just want to make a quick announcement, and that is that uh, I made a video, actually the process of shortening this ska, but um, I'm not going to be able to upload it uh, yet for two and a half more weeks because my account is still in bad standings. So, till then, uh, I'll keep uploading videos the way I've been uploading them, and right now I'm just going to show you how this is. So this is a 16 inch ska now and I didn't have to modify the tang at all. Uh, this comes with a 15 inch tang and that's partially why the ska was flexing so much because it's a 15 inch tang and a 22 inch ska. Now I tried this with a 17 inch tang but I found it to be a little bit too long so I uh, shortened it down to 16. As you can see the kashira is now right side up, okay? The end knots are done proper. The fit is pretty good. Uh, the manuki are right side up, and they are in the gyaku configuration, which is what I prefer, meaning they're on the palm side instead of on the finger side. I prefer that more than with them on the finger side, just to me it feels, fits my hands better. Uh, real quick note on Gyaku Manuki, not all Manuki can be used for that, you know, like say if they're too big, but most Manuki can. Some are a little bit small for that purpose, but they can still fit there, they just won't serve as big of a palm swell. So, uh, the ska before was five hands long, now it is Four, if I hold it like this with my index right on the suba, one, two, three, and four. But I tend to um, hold it with my index a little bit away from the suba, and with this hand not all the way down here, but here. Unless it's a, sh a really short skull, then I'll hold it here. Uh, subject to change. Um, the point of balance on this, okay, is still pretty much right where it was, as you can see, which is uh, about five inches away from the suba. It might be a little bit more tip heavy because of all that wood that I cut off, but it didn't uh, it didn't shift the the point of balance by that much. So I'm really happy with the way it came out. And to me now, this length fits this sword. Now, this ska could be shortened a little bit more, but I'm not going to. I could shorten this down to 15 and a half inches, but to me, 16 inches feels right for this sword. So, I hope this was uh, informative and uh, maybe entertaining. Uh, be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And I'll see you in the next video. See ya.